Well, the victim was traveling down four mile line here in Alton when another driver coming down Los Sevenos ran this stop sign. Now this accident has left the victim with a financial burden and distraught. I wake up and I feel like I'm choking. It's okay. I mean, just every time I try to go to sleep, I wake up trying to catch my breath. Patricia Zuniga relives the accident every night. I thought that was, that was it for me. That was it. I just closed my eyes and I, I'm going to be gone. On Saturday, she says a driver ran this stop sign and hit her car, causing major damage. The accident also left her body bruised, and a doctor says she now needs physical therapy. All this now adding on to this single mother of three's extreme anxiety. You never know when he can be gone in a second. Alton police interviewed area residents and witnesses to the accident. They are now looking for two suspects who were last seen in a green or black pickup with a license plate that starts with DJH. The driver now facing a failure to stop and render aid charge, but police say less than half of the time hit and run suspects are actually caught. So while police investigate, Zuniga waits for justice. That's not fair because, you know, I understand it is just a scratch, but I mean, this is not a scratch. This is a hit, you know, that a person has to live with. And police need help catching this driver who left the scene of an accident. If you have any information, call Alton Police. In Alton, Nadia Glendo, Action 4 News.